Hello, I'm Brent Ferris from the Bearded Man Studios, and in the following videos after this one, I'm going to show you all about ECMAScript 6, or better known as JavaScript 6. So, in order to be able to do that, currently, it has not been released. Uh, I think its actual release date is sometime in June. And so, we have to go around and uh, get the nightly build of Firefox, or any other browser. I recommend this one because it works. Uh, to be able to use ECMAScript 6 and start messing with uh, the structures. So uh, just head over to uh, nightly.mozilla.org. Uh, these builds are for testing purposes only. We're going to download this, install it, and we are going to start using uh, JavaScript 6, and we're going to uh, check out the new class system, scopes, all that kind of stuff, and uh, we're just going to have some fun. So. Uh, I might interchange JavaScript and ECMAScript, just the same thing. So we're going we're gonna to go ahead and uh, download the version that we need for our operating system and install it. So with the magical power of the, 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 the recording, I will probably pause and continue uh, as this goes. I didn't even really need to pause. It, it downloaded super quick. So let's run this uh, installer, and I'm actually on Firefox right now so I'm gonna close out of Firefox while I install this because um, things can't go right having the browser open while installing uh, other versions of it so I'm going to close out of the browser and go through the installation process standard I'm gonna install it to nightly and install it. so now that it has been installed, I'm going to launch Nightly now. So now that it is launched, we get this page. To test out whether we are actually using uh, the correct version, you can open up the console with uh, F12 for the developer tools. And uh, you can type out class test constructor does nothing, terminate, and if you get undefined here and you don't get an error, you are in the right version, and we are ready to begin working on ECMAScript 6. So I'll see you in the next videos.